Hey guys, my name is Ludo. Welcome back to another video. In today's video, we're going to be making a a pillow of some sort. I'm not really sure. Let's uh, let's do it. Before we do anything, though, I do want to show some art that I stole from the local Galleria. This beautiful piece right here. I'm just gonna hang this up right now. So we're gonna put that up. I have my uh, Ditto duct tape here. Would you believe I said it was Ditto duct tape? Take this, and then cut it very, very precisely. I'm getting some nice camera action. You can see that right there. Oh, that is so smooth. It's not cutting. That's not, okay. Abort mission, abort mission. Anywho, got some more scissors. We're gonna just go ahead and just very precision, precision. These aren't doing it either. Okay, that's this is fine. We'll just get a knife. So I only found this. We don't really have scissors in our house. I don't really know why. I don't really know how I'm gonna cut this without cutting my finger off. Kinda smells like ramen. I don't really know why it smells like ramen. That's kinda weird to be honest. And it never kinda crossed my mind that I should probably just try tearing it. That worked a lot better than I thought it would, to be honest with you. Just gonna take that nice connect. Just, just use these two pieces. Saving the environment. How does it look? Pretty terrible. All right, let's go with it. We got some hand cam here because we're doing something very cool today. I'm gonna try and keep it on table. Okay, this has tape on it. Okay, we have got fluff here. This is, this is, okay, that's kind of satisfying actually. What else do we got? We have some, some more fluff. Lots more fluff. Oh my goodness, we have we have green fluff too. Okay, we have all sorts of stuff in here. We have instructions. Okay, anywho, that over there. I landed that on my chair, honestly. You should probably leave a like for that, just saying. Um, okay, step one, set up the work area. I've already got that done. Look at this area, this is amazing. Step two, knot your pillow. Lay your light and dark green fabric on each top of each other. Soft, actually, wow. Oh my goodness. Oh wait, no, 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 I wanna tear this apart. Oh my goodness, I'm learning. Do you see what I'm doing here? Lay this out very gently. Stupid bag, don't need that either. I don't have a big enough desk for this. Maybe I'll move my mouse pad. I'm just gonna throw that on my chair back there. Stupid Snapchat, shut up, I'm doing important things. Two pieces of fat line up as perfectly as possible. You want the fuzzier side to be on the outside, yes. Now we have our green here. I'm not here for perfection, I'm here for, for entertainment purposes only. Got that laid out. Do you see it? Do you see it? It's not very lined up, but you honestly can't really get it perfect. Okay, that's as, as good as we're gonna get it, okay? What is this extra piece here? I don't like this. This is bothering me. Start double knotting your light and dark green fabric together. Oh, it's supposed to be tying it. That's That would've been awesome to know. So I'm supposed to just tie it like a human? Oh, wait a minute, I understand. I understand what I'm doing though, that's good. Um, we're not gonna do it all. We could actually double up on this a little bit if we wanted to. It says to double knot, but I'm not about that life, so I'm not gonna. It's kind of hard to tie. I'm, I'm always, I was always the kid that was really bad at tying like everything, balloons in particular, because I didn't really know how to do it and I was really dumb. Still can't really do it that well, but I'm better than I was back then. The moral of this story is, I'm telling you is that don't give up on your dreams. If you want to tie a freaking balloon, you can tie a balloon. You won't let anyone tell you otherwise. I'm gonna sit in my chair, okay? Cause this is actually the knees. I'm not on a hard floor. The fact is it's hurting my kneecaps. You know, I should do this more often. This is fun. I like arts and crafts. I'm a very creative person. So we've got a bunch of knots so far. I mean, it's not supposed to look pretty. It's supposed to look, it's supposed to be very comfortable to sleep on. I have a very good idea for what I'm gonna do with it afterwards. I'm gonna burn it. Oh my knots just came out, man. Why you do this? Kind of got my grandma sewing needle and did it faster than this. Oh, oh my goodness. there we want to make the head very comfortable it's very it needs to be very puffy because i have a very puffy face 
and it needs to resemble myself because if it doesn't, then it's just not gonna work. I don't want all this stuff on my carpet. So I'm trying really hard not to get it on my carpet. Just gonna tie that. I sorry, I look very aggressive right now. It's just I'm really concentrated. Our avocado is almost done. We need to add the face. This is our face. We have we have some fabric stickers. Um, we're gonna do the rest of this video here. Uh, just my hand cam. I hope it's okay. There we go. We got another kawaii cheek. How much far apart? We'll just put it there. It looks pretty cool. There we go. Kawaii cheek. Another one. Another kawaii cheek. I know you guys can't really see it, but I'll give you a little thing. There you go. There's kawaii cheeks. That's adorable. This is like rabbit in the mouth. We got a nice avocado pillow. And this is our finished product. I know you can't really see it, but this is basically it. 